Florida lady. Hey guys, welcome back to Not Enough Nelsons. As you know, I have 11 daughters. I just got off the phone with one of them. Her name is Cass. You might know her as just Cass. We had a huge conversation about all of the Sephora and Ulta shopping we've been doing lately. Today's video is going to involve Sephora, but probably not the way that you think. First, I gotta go find my seven daughters. Hey girls, how are you? Good. 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 Are we doing a Sephora video? Oh, what the? Uh, that yeah, I went Sephora shopping? Um, Please say yes! Really? Possibly yes. <laughs> there's gonna be good news and there's gonna be bad news. First of all, Presley can't get any Sephora. Shut up! <laughs> But the first step of this video is gonna be pretty simple. I need you to go gather all of your skincare. Oh, no, 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 no. Your, I can't fit it all in that basket. Well, maybe I'll have to give you two. Neither Three, do I. So four. Like, That's a little like, bit. Like, just gather all of that. I also want like your setting sprays and just everything that you put on your face, like your skin. I don't need like lip gloss or eyeshadows or eyeliners or mascara, nothing like that. I, I need stuff skincare? that goes on your skin. Can right? I just do your skincare? And setting spray and stuff like that. Okay. Wait, is he gonna be using this? No. I promise no will be using it. I promise at the end of this video, you are all going to be very, very happy. All right, I'm giving you five minutes and meet me in the YouTube studio. All right. Dude, I've never been so confused in my life. So do you want me to just get all my drugs off? I don't know. That's 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 okay. I got my basket and I have like nothing. None of my makeup's gonna fit in this. Maybe like five things, yeah. Do you see all of this? That's all makeup, but little do you know, I don't use all of it. So I just recently upgraded to Sephora makeup and that's all I have. You gotta fill it with some stuff. I'm just gonna put some random crap in here because I do not want like anything bad to happen. I think my mom's gonna do like a makeup swap. So we're just gonna like get some drunk elephant here. First, I'm some stuff in my closet. Okay, I'm gonna put some Basket. Maybe if a fan is. There's probably gonna be too much, anyways. We have to get my skincare and my makeup. So, this, this. I'm gonna put some like this, like setting spray stuff. I'm gonna put some Wear Beauty, some Glow Recipe. As you tell, my basket is pretty full, but that was just for my secret room. This is not even for my main room. And I have a lot more stuff I have to get. Guys, it's gonna take like me an hour. This one, two, oh, my bubble, my bubble, classic whip, put a Dior blush, uh, rosy drop, three. No, I don't really use that. I use this one more. I'm gonna use baby blush. I don't really use anything else. I'm not excited about this. All right. This, this, these, this, this. I don't even use these, but might as well bring them because maybe something good's gonna happen. I don't know. This, oh wait, hang on. We're gonna put more drunk elephant, more drunk elephant, stuff I don't even use. The say stuff, say this, this. Okay, guys, this is like all I got. So hopefully we're not like trading makeup or anything because they're not going to be happy. <laughs> this. This. Okay. This. Um, this. Um, this. Guys, I just don't know what happens. Uh, serum. This. 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 Now both of these. These. These, this, this. This is kind of odd. Like, I don't know why we're putting all this stuff into this. I don't know what we're doing. This, holy cow, and I'm gonna have to organize this all after. Ah, uh, moisturizer, okay. I think that's it, because if my siblings are gonna use this stuff, I don't want them ruining any of my other stuff. That, and, Got that and I only have four steps to my skincare routine. That's crazy. Got this. I don't even really use these honestly. And we got this. So I wasn't really listening to rules from my mom. Uh, 
guys. This is gonna take a long time. All right, guys, I think my basket's pretty full. We're gonna bring this downstairs and see what's happening. Looks like I'm bringing all of this down to the YouTube room. I'm actually really nervous. I really do not want anybody using this because this is like my prized position right here. So just cross your fingers. We got Cozy going with me. Oh, 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 where'd she go? Oh, oh. As you can tell, my basket is way too full, so I need to put some stuff in this. Guys, Presley has a lot of stuff. Okay, I wanna go downstairs right now. Okay, that's it! Hey, you took a lot of my no, good stuff! No, I didn't! Hey, you already have a lot of good stuff! Let's head back downstairs and finish what we need. Yes, don't come after me because I don't use primer. I don't really use a base, so I'm just fine. Oh, this isn't everything. My other in the other room. Not really rubber. Um, yeah. Okay. Holy cow, Presley! How old are you? Ten years old. She is ten years old, but turning eleven two months. Yes, and she is not one of those not nice ten year olds. I'm not mean in Sephora, but I do love Sephora. She does love Sephora. Also, you're not like uh, do like things with the samples, right? Like push squish no, stuff. No, well, obviously like not. Potions. Yes. Potions. Why would potions. I? <laughs> she doesn't make potions. Do any of you guys, have any of you guys ever made a potion in Sephora? Well, I make it. I made product? it with like no. sample products. I don't even touch those samples. When I products. make it, if and if I do, I put it on my hand. I wipe it all off. Yeah, and I put it on not my hand and I see, on your face. And I see how it feels. So you might have guessed why I have gathered you here today. Have any mm. of you got any guesses for me? No. Making no. potions? You are not making potions. I was like, I'm not wasting my Wait, stuff. We're going to Sephora! Me and Cass had a big talk today. And oh, we realized gosh. that you guys you know, buy a lot of fun products and it's totally fine. I know I get a lot of comments. Why do you let your 10 year old, your 12 year old buy makeup and wear makeup and stuff like that? And I always say, I choose my battles people and I still do choose my battles. However, I noticed how much like setting spray and stuff is on your face. And I thought I probably have to check the chemicals in these products or just the ingredients in general to make sure that they are appropriate for your skin, the ages that you are, that kind of thing. So you're right? planning on checking everything? Yeah, well, I'm gonna look through, I'm gonna tell you some of the items that are not appropriate for your skin. Now, here's the catch. I already know. And I know that you're gonna be not so happy about this, but hang on one sec. Um, okay, so I do have a trash here. For the most part, I am not going to make you actually trash your item. If it's not probably appropriate for your skin, if it's more for aging skin. You're taking it? This garbage is gonna end up in mom's bathroom. It's actually gonna be full of nice products that I will be able to use on my aging skin. I already I know what this is for you because I don't have to this to me and it's retinol and I don't use retinol. Yeah, retinol is actually really used for aging skin and it's important that you only use it when you start getting, you know. Yeah, I honestly don't even use any of this When you stuff become an adult. Yeah, when you become like a, you know, I don't know, when you start getting wrinkles. So maybe around the age of like 25 so you can prevent wrinkles. But, what is you know, for me this would be appropriate. So I'm going to put this, this isn't really the trash people, this is really going into my bathroom, so I'm gonna put it right here by the trash. I want everyone else to get out all of your drunk elephant products and put it right in front of your bathroom. I only put them in here because I thought like however much stuff we had. Uh, the only uh, thing I awesome. use is. I don't yeah. use this. I don't use any of this thing. I, I don't use, use this. Stuff. Stuff. Yeah, like, so it's okay, just put them out in front of your trash. All right guys, they have put out all of their junk elephant products. There's a lot of First of all, I want you to, this was the one that we called out that had retinol in it. Yeah. Any other products? Let's look at the back of all of your bottles. I don't use this very much. Well, I'm not scared of this. This is vitamin C. Can I not use vitamin C? Okay, so vitamin C, let's this. talk a little bit about vitamin C. Vitamin C is actually probably not the best choice for really youthful young skin. What vitamin C does is it lightens your dark spots. Yeah. And you guys don't have dark spots the age that you are. And it can sometimes irritate your skin because it is pretty um, hard on your skin. Basically, this is eye cream. And you really don't need eye cream because eye cream is meant to help make you look more youthful. And if any of you guys have these products at home, 
don't throw them out. Talk to your parents about the ingredients in them and make a decision on what you think is a good amount to use or maybe just use it sparingly. This has what's called glycolic acid in it. And again, it isn't anything that really you need for youthful skin. And in fact, it can make you more sensitive to the sun and easier to get a sunburn. So I don't use that's it. something that definitely I've only used that like twice. What's hard about these products is look how cute they are. They look yeah. super yeah, that's cute. I'm gonna fun. keep on my that's what they my look. look. But the yeah, problem that's... is is you can't buy things based on their looks. You need to look at what is actually inside of them that you're I, putting on your skin. So basically if it has retinol, glycolic acid, lactic acid, or vitamin C, you don't need it. it. Alright, let's try glow recipe. We have gathered all of the Glow Recipe items. Um, most of you have this toner right here. This is what it looks like. This is actually pretty good for your skin. It has more of an organic acid in it called levolinic acid. If I pronounce that right, it's actually pretty okay for your skin because it's organic. This is actually a new Glow Recipe toner and I looked it up. It's actually pretty good as well. It has a lot of natural fruit extracts and oil. So that's actually pretty good as well. This is the Ultra Fine Mist Watermelon Glow. It has a benzyl benzoate in it, and when I looked that up, it's actually not super good for you. It gives us like a 50% rating or 49% rating, which means it's not the best, and it could have some possible well, not good things in it. matters your so skin type. It matters your skin type. All right, well. I'm pretty sure if it's bad And it's good for my skin, because look, smell it. No, I know. Smell it, it smells but so you know good. What, you know what's interesting that she says that? Because sometimes smells can be misleading. It might smell like delicious watermelon and have chemicals in it that is not very good for your skin. So you might want to use this one sparingly. So we're going to talk about Glow Recipe Watermelon Glow Niacinamide Dew, Dew, Dew Drops. Drops. All right, so niacinamide is actually also for fine lines and wrinkles, which it's you guys so do not Look at all those wrinkles. Yeah, look, I have wrinkles on my uh, forehead when yeah, I go those are not wrinkles. And it's also a lightener for dark spots, which means it's definitely for more aging skin. So why don't I give it to Lily? Um, She is not aging. She, she, is. Is. she is. She is 17. Oh. She's, oh. About She's 18 aging. almost. Um, I don't know, we'll have to look into that, but definitely not for a 10 and 12 year old. Next, we're going to talk about what you cleanse your face with. All right, so starting with Sadie, do you have your cleanser here? No, but I use CeraVe. CeraVe, yeah. perfect. I use CeraVe. I use You to People or the La Roche Posay one. I use La Roche Posay, You to the People, or Bubble. I use You to the People. I use. What our stuff is? Garnier. Garnier, Garnier or Bubble. My Stellar Foaming. I use both of them or okay. Bubble. I just use Drunk Elephant Jelly Cleanser. Perfect. All of those cleansers seem relatively good. I'm gonna have to look a little bit more into some of them, but just make sure you don't use cleansers that say for anti-aging or aging skin. All right, next I wanna look at your setting spray. The stuff that setting you spray. see Presley put a thousand sprays on her face. Oh, like there's things. Wet. Show me all spray. your sprays. These setting sprays, you would think they're not really for anti-aging, so you would think that they are mostly okay, but I did look up. This one is actually not super good for your skin, sorry to say. So this is why. Basically, it has endocrine disruptors, which means you probably shouldn't use it in large amounts. And some of those times when they are spraying, I'm telling you, that's a large amount. So it looks so. like Charlotte Tilbury's got our back. Actually, this didn't rate terrible. It didn't really rate great. Either. What is this? It's kind rate? of medium. So it's still so, good to use. So here's what I'm thinking about this. Again, just like one. Or you don't two need sprays. to drown your you face don't need in it. You just go yeah. half. I don't drown my face. Presley uses a ton of these, and so we're gonna start with Tower 28. This one actually is not that bad. I looked it up, and it's pretty good for you, but still smaller amounts, guys. It's chemicals, no matter what. So let's just use appropriate amounts. I use like three squirrels. These three are actually uh, kind of mid. They're kind of okay. They're not super great, but they're not super bad. This one, what I really love about it is there's actually SPF. some SPF in it. Exactly. And so it's Be probably careful. helpful. That one really works. She used this one once in Maui and she kind of just went like this, this, and kind of like here and just she really put it in. Face. She literally had white stripes. Would... Sunscreen is probably the most important thing you use on your face. So I would say I'm gonna give some extra points to the resetting refreshing mist because of that. And lastly, the milk setting spray was 49 out of 100. So again, use sparingly. For the rest of this, we're just gonna quickly go through each of their baskets and see what items they use, and then they're gonna hear the good news. Basically, guys, I just simplified my routine into like three steps for getting ready and getting unready at night. I wash my face, and then I go in and use, I don't know how to even pronounce it, but it's 
La Roche Post exactly. Moisturizer. And then I use Hyaluronic Cream. Next, I use Aquaphor on my lips, and then I just use Babe Lash. This one I didn't know. This is called Buoyant Eye Cream. In the morning, uh, what's this called? Drunk Elephant. Then I use concealer, three different types of blushes to create the perfect shade. Oh. Nice. And then I use mascara, but obviously I didn't bring it down because my mom told me not to. Yeah, so. we don't need the mascara. All right, so for the most part, all of this looks pretty good. I looked this up and it's not too bad for your skin, so good job, Sadie. Mom did not snatch that. Ready, guys? No, 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 no. All right. So this is what I use for my skincare every morning and night. First, we go in with this Tropicals. Then I go in with some Paul's Choice. Little recipe. These three things, honestly, Presley just told me they were good. And then I use this. And then I do use a really good moisturizer, but I didn't bring it because it's not from Sephora. Busted. So this is the moisturizer, moisturizer that she uses. But this is what it has in it. Collagen is actually really good for you. Retinol and hyaluronic acid. Hyaluronic okay. acid is good for you. But if I remember right, you have these little tiny bumps sometimes under your skin and her doctor, dermatologist, said that it was okay to have a little bit of retinol. Just yes. in small amounts and just right on the area that she needs to kind of really exfoliate. But it can be super powerful, so you really should only use it when you're more like Lily's age, like 18. Some of these other products, like all of these ordinary products, I looked them up and they all rank around the 50% as far as safety goes. And the reason is, is because they can be very, very strong. So again, use with just as much as you need. Just really important not to put any of these harsh chemicals right under your eyes because this skin right here can be super, super delicate. So you need to be really careful with what products you put under your eyes, okay? Yep. So honestly guys, I realize all this stuff isn't really that good for my skin, so maybe I should just put this all on trash. <laughs> it's not that it's all not good for your skin. That's a little extreme. We're not trying to be extreme here. We're just trying to be careful not to use anti-aging products on youthful skin. Well, now. I know that these are not good for my skin because these are for wrinkles. These are definitely great for my skin though. I really appreciate actually Charlotte Tilbury's packaging because it does look like it's for more mature like skin just by yeah. looking at it. It. It's a little confusing when you get these bright colored things, but they're actually for aging skin because most you, adults don't like bright things. Yeah, and the kiddos love them, are super attracted to them, and they're putting all of this like really strong stuff on their face. So just again, look at their ingredients. But I'm gonna say that this will be really good over here near the trash. I am actually loving all of this super goop products because it kind of makes sunscreen fun and a little bit more appealing to kids to start using, which is so important no matter what age you are. Look at all of these products that she has, which is super fun. Different ways to add sunscreen, from sticks to sprays to lotions to powders. I looked it up and it's all relatively safe and some of these products are super fun to use and I personally love these for my girls. Next, we're gonna pull out all of her ordinary products. Um, so I looked these up and they're, they seem to be great products. However, a lot of them are super strong, have strong ingredients. Of all of the ordinary products that Paisley has, this one with hyaluronic acid in it is probably the safest. Um, it's a little bit less harsh of a chemical and it's pretty good for you. It's meant for so, moisturizing. So yeah, meant like, for moisturizing. So this one's okay. Oh, I, I know one more. This is also for dark spots. Oh, oh like yeah, dark spots, again, that's more of an anti-aging type system. So let's put that over here. But honestly, guys, I don't use any of this stuff. Do you want me to go grab what I actually use? Wait, what? Are you kidding me right now? I'll let me go grab it real quick. <sighs> So I know you're not supposed to use vitamin C, but I really like it on my skin. My skin loves it. Like mine was, my hair was breaking out so bad, I put that on my face and it cleared really? up, so. Okay, well I would just say be sparingly. I only use it as night. I don't night. use it anywhere near your yes. eyes and it can make your skin more sensitive and sensitive to the sun, so be very careful when you use this. My skin also loves this moisturizer, so. What's moisturizer? Oh, Clinique? Dramatically different moisturizing lotion. Yes, I think this one's pretty okay. Again, I'm okay with my girls using this and that and just sparingly. But again, ask your parents about the products you should use for your skin. All right, Elsie, it is your turn. Show us what you got in your basket. First, I use this face wash. Okay. And then I use this face wash. You already tested yeah, those ones and you said those yeah, ones are good. Those are so. pretty good. This whipped cream moisturizer. This moisturizer is okay. a crunchy. The bubble cloud surf moisturizer. Sheesh, people. And then I use the bounce back bouncing mist toner. Okay. This is scalp scrub. Scalp from scrub. Bubble. The milk jelly blush. We got these from Cassidy and they're so good. Jelly blush. And then right. I got my Pixie Hello Kitty Whip Down Classic Whip SPS. That looks Sorry. like whipped cream. Wow, definitely keep that away it's from sunscreen. back in the ledger. They will think that is edible. That is not edible, people. And then I got the Daydream. 
Niacinamide Serum, Pink Piggy, Collagen Cream, Collagen Cream, the MAC Fix one. Fix it, uh huh. And then I got the Charlotte Tilbury. All right, a ton of the Drunk Elephant products rate about 48 out of 100. That means they are very mid, not the best. Um, even sadly, this sunscreen ranks pretty low just because it has a ton just of- Just smell it, it smells like Hawaii. I know, a ton of chemicals and fragrances in it, which can sometimes, again, be an endocrine disruptor. So use it sparingly. Sometimes it gives me rashes and it stings my face really yeah, bad. Yeah, I would probably say this is best used on the shoulders and arms and stuff like that. And you know, again, talk to your own parents and your own dermatologist about what's best for you. What's funny about all of these products is we've got some very expensive products and of all of these products, this is probably the most inexpensive item here, but it ranks the highest. So those of you out there that can't shop at Sephora, don't have a Sephora near you, just look at all of the ingredients and the products you get because a lot of products at the drugstore and just normal grocery store are pretty good. So I didn't really use that many things. I didn't really put like... Yeah, I didn't really put everything that I used What do you here. use to cleanse your face? It's actually this brand, Youth to the People. I think the Youth to the People is pretty good because it's all plant-based, but again, let's just pay attention when you get your cleanser. Just look on the back and see the ingredients. I use this. It's actually really big, but Paisley told me to get it's this, good. and I did, and it's actually big. We all have it. Yeah. <laughs> what else do you use on your face? Um, I used to use this, and everyone's like, it's so good, but it actually, like everyone has different skin types and it actually made me get bumps all over. Yeah, it matters okay. your skin. Sometimes it'll take away bumps. Yeah, so yeah. as you can tell, I used half of it, stopped right there, and I was like. Yeah, listen <laughs> to your own skin type, right? Yeah. That was very good. I use this sometimes. It is for brightening and it just says clearing mist. For okay. uneven skin tones. Okay, so with that, I think again, that probably has something to do with like dark spots or aging. So I would only use that on a very small basis. And actually on it, it says one to two times per week. So there you go. Just use it very, very sparingly. And really, you probably don't even Yeah. Do so, all right, next. I do have these eye patches that I like to use sometimes. And let's sometimes. put the Say down here just really quick. I know a lot of you might use the Say Glow Drops. And so we're actually gonna see how those are for your skin as well. So starting with the moisturizer that Paisley recommended from La Roche Posay actually rated really good. Like I'm talking 98% out of 100. And then there's this hero stuff. I don't even know what this is. It's pore release. Pore release. Unclogs blackheads and clogged pores. All right, I will look up that one too. And I looked up what the Say's ingredients, you know, how they rank those. It actually ranked really good as well. Not super bad for your skin at all, so that's okay. All right, looked it up. It has salicylic acid, which can be pretty strong, so you need to be careful not to get it around your eyes, but it ranked pretty good for the ingredients. And so, awesome. Delaney, will you kind of tell us what your skincare is? Um, practically just Jelly cleanser, rosy drops, yes. and I think, eye cream. Okay, I think that we actually got this from my room. My it was like, yes. I think her face was dry, so she thought she needed some cream, but this is actually vitamin C cream, and it's actually for aging skin. So we'll make sure that we give you a more appropriate moisturizer. All right, last we have, oh, Presley. Very carefully, be careful. Going to pour things in this out. Holy cow. Now, uh, with skincare and beauty products. Holy okay. cow! All right, we have let all of the other girls take a break because Presley literally bought the whole entire store. So we're gonna go through and just make sure that she's not actually hurting her skin or that we feel comfortable with this. So for me, again, talk to your own parents. These items through here, some of them are not the best ranking. Some of them are like 50%, others are like 80%. So we're gonna go through here and some of these products we're gonna kind of give to this pile over here if they have too many harsh chemicals or we will just use them sparingly at our house. This from Refi is face primer. It actually ranks really high. That's good. So that's good to know. Charlotte Tilbury products, again, they look more mature because they usually are for more mature skin. Some of the they items like hyaluronic shame. acid are okay at my house. They can use those products, but some of the other things with retinol or other anti-aging products probably need to stay well, in. I just I just love the way like this fills on my skin, this fills on my yes. I have two of these. This is how much I love them. Some others I think are appropriately packaged because they look super useful are these products this from Tower 28. 
They actually are pretty good. They're ranked pretty high. So it's I'm excited about that. I have makeup from Excited that. about that. We like to tower 28 at our house. Another product that I'm okay with Presley using is Say. It's like a glow serum, glow. I've had four of these, this shade. Yes. And then, well, these are two now. Yeah, and this is more of a bronzing one. Yeah. Pretty much all of the girls in my family, including me, love Say. So we will keep those around. Sadly, Tatcha, a lot of them rate like 48. I 48, 49 out of 100, which isn't super great. A lot of these are just unsafe in high amounts, so use sparingly, okay? okay? You don't need to use all these products and all these chemicals on your face when you're all my 10 years old! <laughs> all right, we are gonna take the next uh, three hours to go through the rest of her products, and then we invite the rest of the girls back to have the surprise rebuild. What? Yeah, big surprise. Three hours later. Are you guys ready to hear the good news? Yes. yes! However many products that you had to gift to the trash or to me, you get to spend that much worth at Sephora! <laughs> so I, I get to spend the the zero dollars! Yeah, the rest of that to the garbage, 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 Cause my skin's care and everything else is all good for my skin. So I get to spend look, zero. Actually, for those who didn't have to give any items, I'm actually gonna reward them too. So everyone gets at least $100 out here. Yeah! Let's go shopping! All right guys, we are here at Sephora in Las Vegas because it's a lot bigger than the Sephora that we have. Yeah. And we are about ready to we go shopping. We just came from the airport, so it's fine. But I'm, and I'm here. And me too. But remember, hey guys, remember, I told you your amount so you're able to spend $2, based $2, on $2, how $2. much you turn Mine in. Mine was 400 so what? stop it. <laughs> People are excited about this color. We've been looking for it. It's shimmery. It's brand new birthday cake. See, this is my new one because you know how I ran out? Well, I don't need, need that much. I need to restock and then I won't have to buy any more. Okay. <gasps> Look how pretty this one is. Oh, that one's actually pretty because that's like more for like if you This is a beauty blush too. Pretty on you. Wait, this is actually really pretty though. No, it actually is. For face and body. Ooh, that's nice. I think what it's like that? glittery stuff. Yeah, Ooh. it's like a bronzer. See if the ingredients are good. Let's look. Four in one firming peptide. Let's peptide see what's in it. Suds makeup, plump skin, blurs pores, reduces shine. I have to look it up. It's a really good one. It's a really good one. It's really good. Moral of the story, guys, all this stuff looks so fun for like little tweens and even kids, and it's just really important that you look at the ingredients. This is a really good indication of what it's for, so only use it if you need it. Yeah, this will definitely dry out your skin if you use it. You don't want to use this by your eyes. I might try this one. This one is like the facial facial cleanser, and I think I'm getting the getting like the bundle thingy of it, so I can really test it out. That makes I asked Cassidy about it, so she said it was good. And it was good on all, our all skin our app. Tips and it was good on our app that it wouldn't have anything super bad for you. Guys, the amount of times we've been having to sit here and read everything, I know, it's actually crazy. <laughs> Suddenly they're looking at me. Thank you, Mom. You're welcome. Thank you. I got some new workout clothes. And guess what? I got me some stuff. I don't need only hand-me-downs, people. Next, I gotta let Presley and Elsie go to Ulta. Guys, I have Delaney, Presley, Elsie, and we are at Ulta, and we are gonna go spend some money. Yeah! coming up. Are you ready to go? We can take a ride. We can take it slow. Your will is my law. I'ma let you be the boss, cause I'll go with you. Elsie testing out some lipstick colors. For cheer. For cheer. Guys, Delaney's trying to ask for opinions of what to get, but she doesn't really know because she's not much of a makeup girly. So 
She's trying to get some concealer, maybe open her variety of options for makeup. Is that what it's called? Get these things. Oh, to put on your moisturizer, you got. Okay, we're gonna find Delaney some concealer. Uh, all right, we got all of their bags, and now. Stuff to press you know, I, stuff? Think, I think I want to get a little more. Stuff. Oh, okay. Well, I'm gonna I go to the I want to go to Drunk Elephant. Yeah. Oh goodness. Uh -oh. Oh. That's gonna go bad. Oh. And anywhere it's sold out, we are kings of the world. Let's just say Presley went a little overboard, but she did give a lot to the bucket. I will yes. say that. But we all got our stuff, and now we're gonna go home and give you a haul of what we got. Ooh. All right, guys, we're back from our shopping. You guys all have your hauls in front of you? Yes! yes. Pretty right. hefty load. You guys are so lucky. I can't even tell you how excited I would have been when I was your age to have this kind of This haul. is very exciting. I like doing hauls. Very exciting. All right, so the first person we are gonna let do a haul is. Makeup brush, drunk elephant moisturizer, bubble face wash, and then I got my drunk elephant hydration serum, leave in product Paint. for your hair, eyebrow pencil, wow brow, nice. wow brow, Mac, um, red lipstick for cheer. That's all my skincare and makeup. Nice. First, I got this Kiehl's face wash, Tiger Grass Color Correcting Treatment, the Capybara. Capybara, capybara, capybara. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just say Sadie likes Intensive. to go with things that are very no. big. Intensive, <laughs> Intensive soothing repair gel. Kiehl's Ultra oh, Face Cream. Really good. This is the stuff. I've heard oh, that it's very, oh very God. good. This is Kiehl's Ultra Facial Toner. And then last but not least, Kiehl's Truly, Truly Targeted Acne Cleansing Solution. This one we also made sure did not have anything in it that was for dark spots wrinkles or had like retinol and stuff in it. This is just to treat the color on my face when it has acne. First, I got some Clotorex Snow That's so This is Clotorex on toner. toner. Drunk Elephant Eye Cream. Not one, but two, because mine always run out so fast and there's never in stock. Oh my. Next, I have the Clotorex Snow Peptide Cream. Oh. Next, we have Drunk Elephant Be Goldie Drops. Morphe Pink. Powder. Then I got another powder. NARS Paw Concealer. The okay. Fenty Beauty Concealer. The Chantilly Lush, like, thingy. I also got the highlighter because I have a mini one as well as this and I really wanted this shit. I know I spent a little bit over my budget. Little? Oh my gosh, I'm dying of boredom. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, guys, so first things we got is this Clinique. Is that how you say it? Yeah, that's um, Clinique. moisturizer. The sunscreen from Kiehl's. 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 And then I don't know how to say this. New flavor birthday cake. Then we got Makeup by Mario Soft Pop Blush Me Stick. Heart Concealer. Soft. The Ordinary it Peeling is. Solution. Then we got this Summer Fridays uh, it tint. It. it also has sunscreen in it, right? Yeah, yeah so I have it. It's so good. Clinique uh, Moisturizer. My mom said this is really good and she used it when she was younger. We got some Skin Feels Good. Um, skin tint type thing. I got a lot of them because yeah. I wanted to try some. The flawless filter, they didn't have it in the big one, so I got the small one. Then we got the kale plus green tea spinach kale. 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 kale, like what you eat for dinner. Yes, kale. This is all natural yeah, ingredients kale. for um, face cleansing, like washing your face. I've heard it's really good. And then we got a support. I saw this girl on TikTok use this. That's not it. Paisley says it might have not worked for her, but whereas for me, where I have like kind of like rough skin, I get like bumps sometimes and like different, my just my skin is just different, okay? You're supposed to like go around your face and it gets all of those. This girl used a big Dry word. Skin yeah, but it like helps. Exfoliates. Yeah, it helps your skin not to get those pores and it. bumps because Ooh, I don't know. So it's a brush, and you use it on your face. Okay, wow. so. Demolish yeah. pores. And then, last but not least, I got two more summer Fridays. <laughs> Woo! Lily is one summer Friday's summer biggest fan, you guys. Lily! Yeah. Yeah. yeah! She got a lot of stuff for Delaney. Half of this, I made Lily pick out for me. All right. 
Let's see what you got. This is a concealer if I have any red spots on my face that I need to cover up. Then we got some skin tint sunscreen, bubble Bubbly cleanser, up. eyebrow gel. Did you guys know that Delaney literally won her championship? Woo! Bubble moisturizer. Yeah, we love that stuff. Bronzy drops. Presley told me these ones would probably be better. Tarp. They are better. No, you Tarp. can triple. They're all right. That's it. Done. Woo! Try this one really bad. It was sold out everywhere. So, so I got it, and that's never gonna happen to me ever again. Congratulations. And then I got a new blush brush because this is what the Sephora worker em em employee yeah, recommended to me. Uh, I also got this Living Proof Dry Shampoo because my hair loves this stuff. And I got the Summer Friday's lip oil. And then I got a mini Tower 28 product thingy. A bunch of these Tarte, like Maracuja Juicy Lip products. Wait, Wait Mar Mar huh? Mar Maracuja Juicy Lip. This good stuff. is the new Patrick Ta shade, and it is Gorgeous. Show us the shade. Show us the shade. She was like screaming in the store. Cassidy bought two of these and I used it. This is such a pretty color, guys. It's the brand new one they just came out with. It's so pretty art. I got the Tower 28 lip one. And last I got the Cotillade. Cotton serum. Bag. Serum. Perfect. Okay, no. Okay. And you realize as well, that doesn't go on your whole face, that just goes on problem spots, use it sparingly, never bite your eyes or delicate skin. Yes. Oh. And yeah. That's facts. I did that one time and I had a huge burn and it oh, hurt God. so bad. I came to my mom complaining yes, about how bad it was. because it was burny, burny. You wanna be careful about the chemicals all on right. your skin. All right, did we all learn a lesson? Yes! Um, Very chaotic. I also learned a lesson. I will no longer take the kids to Sephora. I will go myself. Well, I think we all learned something. What about I didn't get that much. Good uh, job. I was tame. You're good thing tame. I'm not a kid no more. I'm we stayed in our budget. Ah. From the heart. Be all right. Literally best idea ever.